What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Tanko Bear, Cold Bear Tech Repair, where you get everything tech, news, gaming, and nerd related. And continuing with AMD exclusive week, we are going to be looking at Ifinity Technology. Now, what is Ifinity Technology? Well, it is an innovative combination of hardware and software solutions that reduce the financial burden and technological hurdles involved with configuring and operating a PC multi-display configuration. Now, with iFanity, you can drive up to six, yes, six displays with a combined resolution of 7680 by 3200 on a single GPU. So, what does this mean? Well, you get a lot more real estate for gaming, um, a lot more real estate for programming or doing general tasks. I mean, just imagine playing games over six monitors. And there are a lot of gaming companies that do support this, but there are some requirements for you to use this. Now, in order to experience AMD yeah, Affinity Technology, your system must meet certain requirements. You must have a compatible graphics card, which would be an AMD graphics card from, I think, the 5800 series up. Um, you must have the right display output connectors and the right display. Now, with the different connectors, there are different things they can do. Um, on DisplayPort 1.2, you can have resolutions of up to 2560 by 1600 at 120 hertz, 30-bit deep color, and 1080p multi-view video coding for 3D. For dual link DVI, you can do 2560 by 1600 at 60 hertz and 30 bit deep color. At HDMI 1.4, you can do resolutions up to 1920 by 1200 at 60 hertz, Dolby True HD and 1080p 3D. And VGA, you can go up to resolutions up to 2048 by 1536 at 85 hertz with 24 bit true color. Now, there is a wide variety of ways to connect your video cards or your um, monitors. Now, if you're wanting to go the full out six monitors, you have to have all six connectors be DisplayPort connectors. Um, you can use adapters on anything, but it has to be all DisplayPort adapters. If you're going just two monitors it could be dvi hdmi two vga it doesn't matter but anything over two displays the third fourth fifth or sixth if you go up that high all have to be display port but the first two monitors can be dvi hdmi vga or a combination of those now there's also some software requirements you have to meet um, you have to be using windows 7 or vista or linux and you have to use the AMD Catalyst Control Center. Now, what you do with this is you can um, use multiple display groups, kind of like what you do if you right-click on your desktop and Windows and it shows your different monitors. Uh, you can Im improve the display switching. You can display bezel comp compensation to be able to move the monitors closer together to show them where the bezels are supposed to be. Um, you can color adjust each display separately. It has support for crossfire. Um, window nudging and repositioning. So overall, I, what iFinity does is it allows you to support up to six displays off of one graphics card. Um, but I would recommend using two if you're going to go up to six displays. Um, and like I said, if you want to do two displays, you can do VGA, DVI, two DVI, one, D, v, one DVI, one HDMI. But every monitor after that, up to six monitors, has to be a display port. Now, if you're going the full six monitors, it has to be all display port. And it, you don't have to use a display port monitor. You can use a adapter to your monitor to be able to use this technology. Now, with this, you can put the monitors vertical. Like this, you could have six of them lined up like this. You could have six of them lined up horizontally like you normally do. You could have some on top, some on bottom. You can have them any way you want to. So this is very flexible technology. You can have six monitors, and it's just awesome. All right, guys, if you have any questions or comments about iFinity, please feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section right down below or any other AMD exclusive technologies. If you liked, give it a like. If you didn't, feel free to give me a dislike. You can find me here on YouTube. You can find me on Twitter at TangoBear92. And you can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash Colbert Tech Repair. See you guys next time.